for some is just the opposite for one man, a veteran, who says it causes his body to tense up. I get a knot in my chest, and I feel or I, like, like a, a hurricane, a tornado, like chaos going on inside my chest. Brett Clark says that's how his body reacts when he hears the sound of fireworks. It's really uncomfortable for me to be around and hear the uh, explosions and the percussions. He was active duty in the Marine Corps from 2004 to 2008 and was deployed to Iraq from 2005 to 2006. He says when he got out of the service, that's when he noticed something had changed. I didn't know what was going on with me. I, I knew that I didn't want to go to crowded places. I knew that. Uh, I would get in a fight with my wife when she would want to go. And I didn't realize it was because I did not want to be around so many people. It wasn't until 2013 he says he was diagnosed with post-traumatic stress disorder. It's difficult because I don't like I don't like talking to anybody uh, about it. He faced his fears earlier this week and went to Cross Church's fireworks event. He was amongst a crowd of thousands and loud fireworks. It was just a first for him since being diagnosed with PTSD. That physical not feeling I get or ex experience, whatever that is, didn't go anywhere. He credits his wife and especially his two-year-old daughter for helping him push through his battle. It made me feel like it was worth it. Whenever I seen her smile, I felt happy. I don't want what's wrong with me or what I'm going through to affect her uh, childhood. He tells me he plans to buy his daughter a couple of sparklers like these and will spend the holiday with family. In Springdale, Jonathan Rosell, 4029 News. Well, Clark says he is seeing a psychiatrist who has told him his PTSD may never go away, but it 